Hello everybody and welcome to NCAA Basketball via SBF. We have tip-off coming between the Gonzaga Bulldogs and the Michigan State Spartans. Sal Q. Joe Murr wins the tips for the Spartans. Kai Williams dribbling up the ball to Shane Thompson, now ch uh, to Chug. Back to Shane, deep three. No good, put back up and in by Sal Q. Joe Murr. Alfie Hayes with the ball. Trying to dribble past Sal. Gets it to Alex Hayes, gets the screen from Mike Concho. Gets it to Ray Cortez, short jumper, no good. Rebounded by Michigan State. Force jump shot is no good from Chug. Cortez finds Alex for the easy layup. Williams bringing up the ball. Guarded by Alfie. Hands it off to Chug. Chug steps back. Finds Kai. Sal to a wide open chug, no good. And the three is good from Alex Hayes. Michigan State looking to respond here. Haven't been able to get much going so far, but it's very early on. Behind the back pass to Shane Thompson. Gets the ball to Kai, wide open. Off the back of the rim, rebounded by Mike. Barlow with the ball. Passes it to Alex Hayes. Goes up. Off the glass and in. Alex Hayes has been the go-to scorer, scoring all the points tonight for Gonzaga so far. Chug with the ball. Guarded by Alex Hayes. Shane Thompson, open three. Off the back of the rim, no good. Hayes. Alex Hayes tries to go under the legs to Mike Honcho, no good there. Gets the ball back and now Maverick Varlow has the ball and he's gonna fade away three. Did not expect to close out that fast. Rebounded by Sal. Sal gets it back to Williams. Williams driving against Alfie. Too strong. Rebounded by Car Mike Honcho. Alfie with the pass to Ray Cortez. Cortez to Alex Hayes. Alex to Alfie. Alfie loses it on the way up, but Mike Honcho gets, uh, gets it, gathers it, and puts it in. Spartans not able to get anything going on offense so far, and they're going to call a timeout here. Could be smart. Don't want to let this early lead build any bigger. Draw something up. See the ball go in the basket. That's going to be the idea here. Michigan State has three non-AI players. And Gonzaga has all non-AI players. The two AI for Michigan, or Michigan State are Chug and Dylan Watson. The power forward and the small forward. Kai gets it to Shane. Shane to Chug. It's the screen. Deep two, no good. Rebound at Honcho. Honcho to Alfie. Alfie setting it up. Drives off the glass and in. And Zaga off to a quick start. Chug trying to drive it on Alex. He's going to pass out of this one to Shane. Shane to Kai. Williams steps back three. No good. 
nothing going in for the Spartans right now. Still only two points. And there's the lay-in from Cortez. Gonzaga's defense has been phenomenal so far. But even when the Spartans get open shots, they have not gone in. And the second timeout being burnt in the first quarter here for MSU. Michigan State and Gonzaga neck and neck position wise for standings. Gonzaga trying to create a little bit of breathing room for them. Kai shoots the three, too strong. Michigan State has not gotten anything to go down. And when it rains, it pours as there's another quick basket by Gonzaga. Still a minute to go, uh, to go left in this quarter. Ideally, MSU probably wants to cut this down to at least single digits before the quarter ends. And there's the bucket from, uh, from Williams. Cuts it down to 11. Big lead, hot start for Gonzaga. And there's a quick bucket attempt. No good. Cortez misses that one. Sal gets it to Shane Thompson. Gets it to Chug, open three, no good. Alfie gets the screen from Cortez, shoots the mid range, six it. Thompson with the ball. Williams gets a screen. Passes out to Watson, moving mid-range, no good. Tipped up by Sal, but he can't gather it. It's a rebound for Mike Concho, gets it to Alfie. Alfie's got five seconds left to shoot. Mid-range shot, off the glass, no good. Rebounded, but it doesn't matter. It's the end of the quarter, and it is a big lead for Gonzaga so far. Michigan State only able to put in only able to put the ball in the bucket two times this quarter. Alfie with a quick layup and one attempt coming. Gonzaga not laying off the gas. immediately attacking that rim. Three point play it is, 16 point lead for Gonzaga. Michigan State is struggling mightily. Nothing going right on either side of the court. Size mismatch down low, not taking advantage of it. Chug's going to be forced to shoot a three. Almost goes in, but rattles out. Alfie's pushing the ball down the court. Varlo wide open, and that's in. 19-point lead for Gonzaga. Thompson gets the screen. That's no good, rebounded by Honcho. Varlow. Fakes, goes up, gets blocked by Sal. Goes up a second time, rebound by Sal. Now Sal's gonna push it up the court. He's gonna shoot a three. Not sure what he's doing there. He does not do that often. Michigan State is dysfunctional right now. Thompson. Gets the screen. Finds Williams. Three. That's good. 
first points of the second quarter is the three from Williams with four minutes left. Alex Hayes gets it to Maverick. Finds Cortez, deep three is open and he sinks it. You could hear a pin drop in this court. This home crowd is absolutely silent and there's something to cheer about as Williams makes back-to-back -back threes trying to give some sort of life to this offense. There's the steal from Sal. Thompson, pump fakes. Turns, he's gonna drive. Goes right at Varlow and gets under him. That's a bucket and we have some life on offense for MSU. Can they make this a competitive game going into halftime? There's good defense down low. Williams with the ball. Gets it to Sal. Sal guarded by Mike. Misses. Kicks it back out. Thompson up top now. 11 seconds left on the shot clock. Six seconds. Thompson not getting a screen. He's going to be able to forced to shoot a three here. That's no good. And they've got a mismatch. Mike Honcho is way too big and strong to be stopped by Chug. Williams on Honcho. Wants to drive by him. Nothing there. Honcho, a good defender all around. No movement here on offense. Chug is going to be able to force to shoot a three again. And that's no good again. Rebounded by Dylan Watson, though. Chug's going to find Williams, shoots the three, and that's good. The lead is down to 15. Still a very big lead early for Gonzaga. Uh, this offense has finally come alive. But the defense still has issues as Alfie Hayes gets by the defender and puts it down. Williams gets it to Chug. It looks like they've been trying to get Williams and Shane open off ball with off ball screens, letting Chug facilitate. So far it's been working for Williams. First free throw is good, second shot at the line. Also good for Williams. Alfie with the ball. Alfie finds Cortez on the cut, and that's an easy bucket. Laps of defense there. Williams gets it to Chug. Scream. Williams on Honcho. Sal passes out of the mismatch. Chug's going to shoot the three and makes it. Chug finally hits the three. Cortez, off the glass and in. 16 point lead for Gonzaga. Michigan State finally coming alive. Scoring 16 and potentially more here in this quarter, but Gonzaga has not slowed down either. Williams is going to try to drain as much time off the clock as they can. Don't want to give a good shot to Gonzaga to end the quarter. And there's Thompson open for three, and it is in. Five seconds left. You could probably you could probably get a good shot in here. And there it is, Mike Honcho. Quick bucket. And what a half it has been. Monumental ups and downs for the Spartans and Gonzaga taking over.
This Gonzaga team has seen its fair shares of ups and downs throughout the season so far. And this is the sort of buzzsaw offense that this team can bring at any moment. And scares, at least me, with this kind of potential. Cortez on the AI Watson with some amazing dribble moves. Left-handed finish is no good. Quick moves there from Cortez. And there's a quick bucket on the other end from Chug. And back to Cortez. He is so athletic for his size. It is ridiculous to see him play. He has the tools of a very good prospect, in my opinion. And he looks like he's putting it together. Pancho, first shot's good. And so is the second. Now, running Chug on the point has been very interesting for MSU, but it looks like it's working because you have two very good shooters in Thompson and Kai. And there's the block. That's what you don't want to see from Michigan State's offense, is him actually going to the rim. You want to set some off-ball screens, get people open for three. It's been working. There's the screen. Hard to call this a mismatch, but you have a power forward on a point guard. Sal Q. Joe Murn doesn't make the corner three. Kai can't block it. Alfie Hayes puts it in. Alfie has had a phenomenal game so far. Facilitating this offense and scoring. Making sure this team does not slow down. Keeping the pace. And off the glass and in off that jump shot from Williams. Effective field goal percentage. Very good for Kai Williams. Very important stat in my opinion. Chug. Gets it back. No good from Sal. Rebounded by Mike Honcho. Honcho has been a board machine. The screen. Alfie with a pass. Maverick loses it. Chug's got it in transition. They're gonna pull up for a three. No good, rebounded and put back up and off the glass by South Q. Joe Murray. Michigan State doing everything they can to not let this game get any further away from them, but on defense, quick buckets have been killing them. And there's the quick bucket from Kai. Alfie, alley-oop to Hancho. Another quick bucket from Gonzaga. They don't even have to set up their offense. They're not able to stop their cuts. Chug, waiting, looking around. Thompson fakes the jump shot. Williams misses, rattles out. You're going to start needing these to go in as we get closer to the final minutes of the third quarter. You don't want to be down by 20 going into the fourth. Not an insurmountable lead, but it's going to be hard to come back when the offense is humming like it is for the Gonzaga Bulldogs.
There's the lay-in off the glass for Williams. Williams now guarding Alfie in isolation. They're gonna let Alfie try to go to work. Picked up on defense. Up and in for Mike Honcho. Better defense there for Michigan State, but still not good enough to stop them. Shane Thompson lays it in. Harlow misses the jump shot. Chug in transition. He's going to stay with the play design. Turns around, gets the foul, got Cortez up in the air, took advantage of it, went up with the shot. Two shots at the line for Chug, smart play there. First shot is no good, not a very good free throw percentage for this guy. Yep, no for two. Shane Thompson steps back. No good. Crazy shot there. Michigan State is looking desperate right now. And there's the foul. Contact is going to send Cortez to the line. First shot is good. And so is the second one. Williams. Behind the back. Going to wait for that final shot. He's got six seconds left. He gets the screen. He's going to pull up for the shot. No good. Rebounded and put back up from Sal Joe Murr, but misses the open layup. And it is going to be a 19-point lead for Gonzaga going into this quarter. And, man, if the Spartans could have come out to a better start and not had that awful first quarter. This could be an amazing game. Michigan State has kept up with Gonzaga for the most part on offense since about the middle of the second quarter. But they needed to massively outperform Gonzaga to make up for that awful first quarter. And there's the deep three from Chubb. Cortez. Gonna take the contested shot, rebounded by Watson. Makes the three. If I was muted this whole time, that is disappointing. So we have Chug. Get it to Williams. In. And this game would have been phenomenal if Michigan State hadn't started off to such a terrible start scoring only four points in the first quarter total and allowing Gonzaga to start to it with a big lead. And Gonzaga has not laid off the pedal since then. Michigan State started performing a lot better in the middle of the second quarter and has been playing pretty much step for step with them. So regardless of what the outcome is, because you can almost call it now for the Bulldogs, you have to think. If they had not gotten off to that slow start, the Spartan teams look like they can uh, can compete with a Gonzaga Bulldog team that looks like they're on their A game.
Thompson defending Varlow. Chug goes for the quick layup, gets it and to the free throw line. Not a very consistent free throw shooter is Chug. Anything but a gimme here. No good. Rebounded Honcho. Alfie gets the space he wants off the dribble. Wide open for three, drills it. Good for Sal Q, Joe Murr. Alfie. To Hancho, lays it in. Williams gets the screen. Great pass and find there to Chug. Two minutes left. This game is over. But Michigan State not giving up at any point. But great work all around and all night so far from Gonzaga. And there's the block from Sal Q. Joe Murr. Gets it to Kai Williams. Gonzaga has been doing pretty much everything right tonight. Michigan State having to work for their buckets. Screen. A foul. Cortez gets called there for trying to get the steal. Got a lot of contact there. The throw in. Thompson with the ball. Watson, Watson scores. Watson and Chug, the two AI players. Chug been the more impactful player as they change their scheme to letting Chug control the ball and let Kai and let Shane try to get open off ball. So far, that seems to be a good strategy going into their next game. As Varlow hits another three. Running up the score. Michigan State still going to try to look to end on a good note. Williams to Chug. Williams trying to get open off the ball. Can't shake loose Cortez. Cortez, screen, three, too strong. Rebounded by Alex Hayes. Cortez. Loses the ball. Kai Williams has it. Shane Thompson misses the shot. Alfie, guarded by Thompson, gets by him. Lays it up at the rim, no good. Rebounded by Hancho. He's gonna put it back in with the jam. Asserting his dominance to end this game. Final possession for MSU. And there's the jump shot from Williams. That'll be the last shot of the game. 19 point win for Gonzaga. Very atrocious start to this game, but there was a lot of action throughout it and a lot of scoring. This was a fun one. Hope you guys had a good time. Make sure to leave a comment in the comment section. Get your points. This has been Lions signing off.